Time for a math lesson, everybody. We're going to look at the Premier Organics Hemp Premium Hemp Oil, 100,000 milligrams. What does that mean, 100,000 milligrams? We have one fluid ounce, 30 mils. So if we do a little bit of math, let's look here. We have 100,000 milligrams. There's 1,000 milligrams per one gram. So if we take 100,000, divide it by 1,000, we're going to get 100 grams. Now let's look at the volume at which this bottle contains. One fluid ounce, 30 milliliters. Typically, an oil is going to be approximately 0 0.92 grams per milliliter. So if we take 30 milliliters, 30 milliliters multiplied by 0 0.92 grams per milliliter, that's going to give us approximately 27.6 grams. So what this container is telling us is we have 100 grams of hemp oil inside a 27.6 gram container. Now you tell me, does that work? I don't think it really works, everybody. So this product, I'm going to have to say, based solely off labeling, is kind of impossible. But let's look at the cannabinoid content anyhow, because it is interesting to find out what we get when a product does have organic hemp seed oil. Let's see what that looks like. Nice part is about this product, you buy one, you get another one. I, I love it. These guys are giving stuff away. There's no tomorrow. Anyhow, let's test it. Let's find out if it's got cannabinoids. Cannabinoids are what we like to look for. Simple math call outs that, I, honestly, I didn't see that coming. I didn't think math was going to prove a product as being bad. But here we are today using mathematics. Go math, everybody. Let's study up. People, people gather around me. Yeah, you see it's our time. All right, everybody, time for some test results. This one, again, claims to be a hemp seed oil. Now, hemp seed oil, that comes from the hemp plant. It comes from the seeds that are in the flower, and then they're pressed to remove the hemp seed oil. That's probably going to come with some cannabinoids, and that's what we saw with this one. Trace amount, small bit, in the whole bottle, we got 0 0.72 milligrams of CBDA. Again, that is the acidic form of CBD. Now, CBDA, CBD, THC, THCA, these are all cannabinoids that interact with your endocannabinoid system. Everybody, if you don't know what that is, it's worth taking some time and getting on the internet. The endocannabinoid system, it goes to our whole body. It has to do with inflammation. It has to do with controlling pain. We can really do a lot by understanding that system in our body. Now, we make our own cannabinoids. Each one of us makes cannabinoids inside our body to interact with the endocannabinoid system. But just as we do with other medications, we can take something so that it also interacts with that system. And that's what we're looking for in these products that we're looking at, right? We're looking for a cannabinoid profile. So what did we see today here? We saw some cannabinoids. This has a cannabinoid in it. My mom, she's looking for a more robust cannabinoid profile. She wants a wider range of cannabinoids. She wants more cannabinoids. So what we're looking for for her is a little bit more of a uh, straight flower extract product. We're looking for the resin glands to be removed from the flower so that people are getting the high CBD concentrates we're looking at. Not necessarily concentrates, infused products. This one, it was low, but it had some CBDA in it. Pretty sure that's coming from a hemp plant, everybody. So again, thanks for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed what you saw. If you did, go ahead, let's hit that subscribe button. There's a like button over here. If we hit that, that's going to let other people know what you think of our show. By letting other people know, we're going to bring people in. Bring your friends in. Send them over to Testing by Brian. Find products that work for you. Send me an email. Let me know what's working. We'll let other people know. We're here to get good products into people's hands so that they're getting the benefit of the cannabis plant that is available. 
That's all we can do, everybody, is we can try. So thanks again for tuning in, and that's another episode of Testing by Brian.